Hey, good morning, it's Owen Bigland. This is the Inside Edge video blog. Not a month goes by when I don't get at least two or three people ask me about these real estate investment seminars uh, that they'll periodically uh, roll into town here, into Vancouver, uh, and if they're a good deal. And uh, I'll save everyone uh, a, a lot of your time, and in some cases, a whole lot of your money, and cut right to the chase here. Uh, these real estate seminars are pretty much all of them are uh, a complete scam and a waste of time, and I would uh, avoid them at all costs. Uh, you know, essentially how they draw people in, uh, they'll, they'll, as I say, they'll roll into town here every two or three months and blanket the radio stations and run some ads in some of the free newspapers for a free two hour seminar at some hotel out in Burnaby or Coquitlam or Richmond. And uh, in that two hours, they'll sit you down and they'll tell you that it's easy to get into real estate uh, and for no money down either. Uh, they'll be very vague on it, but essentially you don't need to have 50 or 60 or $100,000 sitting in the bank account. You don't need any of that. We can get you into real estate. We'll show you the proven methods to buy uh, properties and sell properties with little to no, no, none of your own money. And uh, they'll entice you to, to sign up pay $1,500 or $1,800 or $3,000, it's all over the road, to sign up for a weekend course where they'll give you all the details on it, as well as some books and courses. I can tell you, I'll cut right to the chase now, uh, these are all the same premise. These no money down, uh, what they'll tell you is that you need to approach uh, people knocking on doors or going through Craigslist and try and find for sale by owner homes. But you have to be one step better. You also have to find uh, sellers who are willing to sell that have free title, a uh, clear title to the property. They can't hold a mortgage. If you can find them, you go in and negotiate a deal with them with no money down and you will purchase the house directly from the seller, from the owner. Now, I can tell you folks that these, these schemes do not work. Uh, it's like finding a needle in a haystack, especially in a city like Vancouver. Finding a for sale by owner, well, they're less than 1% of the sales to begin with. Then finding a for sale by owner who has clear title, and then, and then one more step, finding a for sale by owner with clear title who wants to deal with you at arm's length, not using any banks or lawyers or anything else. The premise is, is that you'll negotiate a price, uh, you'll write a contract, and you will start paying that seller uh, essentially a mortgage payment, but instead of going to the bank, it'll go to the owner. These deals do not work. Uh, as a matter of fact, I've got a couple of uh, uh, pages in my book that'll be coming out next year talking about these, these uh, scam seminars. Um, you know, to buy real estate and get into real estate, you've got to, there's only one way to do it, and that's the right way. And that is to save your money for your down payment, whatever that is. I mean, you can buy a, fantastic one-bedroom condos right now in Richmond uh, for $200,000. So if you can qualify, $10,000 down is all you're going to need. Get qualified for a mortgage, get a realtor, and you're in the game. Uh, if you want to buy a condo in Vancouver, again, you might be able to qualify for 5% down, but you're probably going to need more like about twenty-five dollars or $30,000 down payment. You see, that is the biggest, that is really the only barrier to people not getting into real estate. It's coming up with that down payment. If I were to ask a hundred people who are renting right now why they're not uh, owning, uh, because the cost to own is actually cheaper than renting right now when you've got 2% interest rate. 99 or 95 percent of, of the people that are renting right now, there's always five percent that just want to rent and they don't want to commit to ownership and that's fine. Maybe they've got a short-term goal, they're only going to live here for a few years, then they probably are better off renting. But the vast majority of renters would tell you the reason I'm renting is because I don't have the fifteen or twenty or thirty thousand dollars down. I'm still in the process of trying to get that money together, the down payment. So that is the big hurdle to buying real estate. But once you get that down payment, you're in the game. Get qualified for a mortgage and you're off to the races. With these no money down seminars you hear on the radio, you're avoiding the middleman. You're avoiding the bank. You're also avoiding the realtor, that overpaid realtor, they'll tell you, and dealing directly with the owner at arm's length. Good luck with it. Uh, as I say, I've got a little ver a bit of it in, in my new book coming out. I'll tell you a couple of horror stories in there. There's a very good chance you're either going to get ripped off, get sued, 
spend hours and hundreds of hours trying to put together deals that never come together. Do it the proper way. Start saving for your down payment now. Get yourself a realtor. Get yourself a good mortgage broker and do it the right way. The other thing uh, that people will also ask me about occasionally will be some investment seminars, stock trading uh, seminars. And I hear these all the time on CKNW. Uh, they, they've bought some infomercial time now I see on the weekends. Another gigantic scam. Uh, only one that's going to make money on these things are the people that are selling you these trading courses. Uh, I've blogged about it before, and again, I'll talk about it in my book too, uh, that trading stock, getting in and out of positions is a mugs game. Uh, it eventually is like Vegas going and playing uh, uh, blackjack or roulette. The house will wear you down. You'll end up losing all your money. The better way to do it is to buy quality blue chip stocks that pay a dividend and hold them for long periods of time. That's the way wealthy, successful people do it. That's the way you should do it as well. So these get rich type seminars, they sound good on the radio, uh, but they're just that. They're a get rich scheme that appeals to people that don't want to do it the right way. They want to do it quick. Uh, and uh, again, I would advise you to save your time, save your money and avoid them. Do it the right way. I'm Old Big One. As always, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.